Hi, I'm Nora Garcia and this is your LC Lowdown. Our city will be hosting a town hall meeting open to the public at 6 p.m. on Thursday, November 8th at the Civic Center. Over the past year, the city of Leak City has been working with various engineering firms and stakeholders to study drainage issues in the neighborhoods and subdivisions that flooded during Hurricane Harvey. We encourage you to join us for this town hall meeting to learn more about the next steps moving forward. It's not too early to start planning for the holidays. The Leak City Proud organization is now selling tickets for the Leak City Holiday Ball on Saturday, November 10th, which benefits the Holiday in the Park festivities. This is a black tie optional dinner at South Shore Harbor Resort and will feature live entertainment by the Mambo Kings. Tickets are $65. You can buy them online at LeakCityProud.com. And Lake City Proud is also now accepting applications for festival sponsorship, vendors, and entries into this year's Grand Night Parade. You can find more information on the Lake City Proud website. We have two upcoming events on November 11th. Our first is our annual Veterans Day event at the Chester Old Davis Sportsplex. The event, which is sponsored by Amoco Federal Credit Union, is free to attend and lunch will be served at noon on a first come, first served basis with limited seating. All residents and veterans are invited to attend the annual ceremony. Also on the 11th, the Leak City Parks and Recreation Department is teaming up with the Leak City Dog Park Association to host a first birthday party for the Bark Park at Countryside. The event is from 3 to 6 p.m. and will feature vendors, food trucks, pet adoptions, and a canine demonstration by the Leak City Police Department. A shuttle service will be available at Bay Area Church. This event is free to attend. That's all we have for you today. Make sure to check our new and improved website for more League City news. See you next time.